Hey guys, welcome to day 51 of my journey to 2000 ELO. Today, before I start, I would like to share with you a section on my YouTube channel where I decided to answer some of your questions. Uh, this is the community section. And basically, since some of you want to know what I am doing, uh, here it is. A list of things that, um, that I'm studying or that I'm trying to do when I play. Uh, yeah. I'll try to keep this list up to date. So every 10 days, I'll, uh, I'll update the list. I'll uh, share with you what I'm doing, what I'm studying, what I've done. And uh, yeah, then you can maybe use that for your own training. Or uh, of course, you can also give me some suggestions. I appreciate those as well. I'll try to keep the list um, somehow short. I don't want to have like 20 things because that's very unrealistic uh, and I'm very busy, so I don't have that much time. But uh, but I think it's, it's, it's good to share the list with you. You can always give me some advice. You can always uh, take something from the list. So here it is in the community tab of my uh, YouTube channel. With that being said, let's see who we are playing today. Now, I am a little bit more... Um, uh, well rested compared to yesterday because uh, today the project uh, today we have to film in the evening so I'm a little bit uh, yeah a little bit more relaxed uh, I'll be very tired later so I decided to film before I go to um, I go to film and uh, I think that might help now we are um, playing white. Just double checking that, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I discovered that you can play unrated games and I thought from now on, uh, whenever I just wanna play chess, but I'm a little bit tired, I just, I'll play an unrated game. Uh, I think it's a, it's a nice compromise. You can just have fun and you don't have to, uh, And you don't have to worry about the points. Oh, I hate that start. Um, would like to put my my knight here. Hmm. Let's do this. Let's try to attack that pawn. Um. That's uh that's that's annoying. That's annoying. Mm. And that's actually a um a response to the to the Vienna game that I've never seen, the Vienna opening. Mm. So it's like a from Rui Lopez type of response. <laughs> so let's see. Um, what's next? I think there is either this or a castle. My opponent is taking a long time. What else can he do? Well, he could force trade. Or, or there is this to force uh, my opponent there. Mm. Yeah, I think uh, I'll 
Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess he's going to castle. Um, let's see. Do I want to castle? What do I want to do? Hmm. Let's let's castle. And then I will deal with the with the bishop. I guess he's gonna castle. Oh no, he's not gonna castle. Okay, why is he not gonna castle? What's the plan here? What am I missing? He wants to uh, maybe attack this home. I feel I have to. Um, the fork there oh that could have been okay fair enough fair enough mm, let's see I take he takes So the queen there, I'm thinking what to do when I have the queen there. Mm, maybe here. Mm, I, I have to develop. I have to develop my pieces. Mm. Do this to protect that and allow this. Um, if he gets in, I guess we have to trade. Uh, I was so tempted to throw away pieces, but I'll try to play without throwing away pieces. So let's push maybe this guy away. Um, maybe. Actually, I'm thinking of, of, of tactics. And I read, um, I think someone suggested me uh, to start playing with the intent of improving your position and not only finding like an amazing tactic. Uh, because as you grow uh, or as you get better, you will encounter players that are basically very good at defending everything. And so you have to slowly slowly improve your position uh, that's a it's a hard thing to do because to be fair i don't not exactly uh, aware of what constitutes a good improvement in position but i'm trying trying to improve on that side Maybe not throwing away big pieces. That's that's a good start. Uh, 
Okay, so he went for that. Mm -hmm. I think I think he might so I'm, I'm, I'm thinking how to improve my position so I'm trying to yeah implement what has been suggested to me maybe maybe that solid three guys uh, actually no what am I saying this then is well it's defended mm, but then when I push there is a hole or push there but then this becomes like a, kind of a weak spot and there is two guys for that um, having a hard time I'll, I'll go for that I'll check later in uh, with Stockfish to see what was the best best approach I think the problem with this strategy is that then if I attack the queen this one becomes very weak and then yeah basically the knight can take all the pawns yeah I mean I will end up oh and also there is this that's not nice uh, I'll move it just to avoid the uh, surprises like a check when yeah in the worst possible time um, so that would be nice it takes I cannot take back mm -hmm. That would be annoying. He takes. Actually, I can do this because if he takes, I can take back. Mm. So I'm trying to defend that guy. I feel I need to attack the queen. expecting that <laughs> I was really not expecting that um, so let's see um, if I take he takes I cannot take back he risks to take that if I don't take, where can I go? Pretty much that's the only square. I could do this. To save my queen. Not exactly sure is a good way. I'll, I'll do this because I think if I lose the queen right now, I'm pretty much lost. Mm. Uh, it took a long time to come up with this move. I uh, need to start to play faster. Probably the only move I have.
Yeah, I was kind of expecting that. Um, let's see. He really wants the queen, which tells me that it's better not to lose the queen. Amigo here. Because I can go up, can go there, uh, can go eventually here. Mm, and if he takes that, I take. If he takes this, I take. Yeah, I guess. Mm. He's probably going to move this, in my opinion. Need to attack. Hmm. So two rooks, two bishop, one knight and one queen. And I have one bishop and two knights with the two rooks and the queen, so from that point of view, we are more or less the same. He has one additional pawn, but the structure it's not looking good. Not looking good. Mm. I mean, not the structure, the position. Uh, it's it's also. Let's let's see what he's playing. Sometimes I wish I could see the evaluation bar because to me this game looks like almost lost. Um, but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I'm wrong. Uh, mm -mm. So let's see. I don't want to do that because then he's going to take with this and it's going to open that. I cannot go here because there is the rook. So that would be bad. Maybe this align with the two guys. Ah, but then I lose the, the knight. Let's move the knight away. I'm like a seven on this move. Um, yeah, let's move the knight away. Maybe you can push that. So the good thing is that yeah, everything seems to be defending pretty good. Uh, let's see, he goes for that, I can go for this, he takes, I take, am I missing something, let's see, he takes, I take, he can go down for a checkmate, but the other rook is still there. Um, maybe I need to open something here. Mm. Or maybe that's just there, so that when I move the 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 knight, he can take. 
that that's also a possibility. I was a little bit lucky because with 30 seconds kind of difficult to win this game. Uh, I would really analyze the game afterward. I think I think he was better positioned than me. But I, I need to see the the evaluation bar. So that was game one. Let's take a look at uh, who is our next opponent. We have that's a flag El Salvador. Uh, it's a flag that I've never seen before. Mm -hmm. Let's see. So I'm looking for another uh, another opening for black because I play a little bit the Karakan against the um, this uh, the computer on the, on leeches, and there is I just. It's not my opening. I I have such a hard time. It's it's incredible. It's very very difficult for me to get out. I just find myself uh, trapped all the time. And I don't seem I don't seem to be able to make good progress. If that makes sense. Um, They do this, it's coming that. Should I push the pawn? I think I will push the pawn. No. Let's see, this one is very important. So if I do that, oh, this pawn is not protected. Okay, let's do that then first. There is still that. Mm -hmm. Starting to think that maybe it's not a good idea to cast on this way. Mm. I didn't see that my, oh wow, that is interesting. I cannot do that. I cannot do that. That is such a wild way to play this. Mm. So my good bishop is gone. Um, almost tempted to castle queen side. I'm thinking where I can put my queen though.
or push that let's see he can go here he can go there let's, let's annoy this guy ah but there is the king okay hmm let's do first this then i'll try to annoy this uh, knight or he's gonna go for that um, let's see this I have a rook there um, not sure then I can go back Oof, careful. The idea is to maybe do something like this. Wait a sec, why? Open the bishop to do something like this to attack the rook. And yeah, to attack the rook. I feel he's playing super aggressive and um, I don't know exactly what to expect my bishop then I have only two rooks um, I'll think uh, what stockfish would think so let me take it mm. maybe do this so I'm still defending that there is that he can go here ah sh sh I wanted to go there damn it um yeah, let's see, what can we do now? Mm. Mm. Let's defend that pawn. Disappointed, but I guess that's the that's what happens when you play um, with the computer and the mouse. I wonder if good players do these mistakes as well. I don't know what to do. I think the game is kind of doomed. I mean, 
you can still get the pole in the middle. It's gonna be tricky because he has the two diagonals. But maybe I can push these three pawns forward. Uh, maybe he's going the back. he takes if I don't take I end up with one pawn anyway but if I take at least he's on another diagonal stuck um, all right anyway I tried good game good game um, I mean I don't want to be too harsh on myself I just I just had like the good move in mind I just mm, missed uh, missed click I'll sleep, I'll sleep. Let's have a third game and let's see if I can redeem myself. So we are playing with white and we are playing against a player from the Philippines. All right, let's see. Anderson. I don't think so this is the right the right version there is only one line on the modern chess openings book I think for the Anderson and it's like line 18 and um, I'm pretty sure it involves the bishop and not the queen but there is one on the Max Lange where you have that then he pushes down you move here and yeah basically you you end up with like a bishop here and a queen here um let's see what he does there is always the option of like him just sacking the bishop so that I have my queen, my king there, I guess. Yeah. I wonder what 
he's thinking. Oh, he's thinking to the F2. Alright, so if he's thinking to the F2, let's put the, the knight here. And the other one is going there as soon as possible. Can't complain. Um, ah, actually, I can complain because he's going to attack that. Oh, man. That's why in the line at a certain point you just move it down so that you avoid that. I'm not sticking to my checks, captures and threats. Mm. Let's see what he does. I think he's, he's thinking whether it's nice to play without a queen. wild but I see this game going in a very wild direction so not exactly sure mm, let's see I am afraid that the next move would be the rook, but let's well, let's try to get this first. That one would be annoying. It okay, so what's next? We're gonna lose these things. I take, he takes, I go there to defend, he maybe he takes, I take. We're gonna end up with like one rook and three pawns. Yeah. What happened that this game went so crazy? Uh, I guess. Well, I messed up with the with the queen move, and then it was just take, 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 take.
so I do this because if I do that then there is a rook I cannot castle What just happened? Look at this position. I completely let's see. Uh, I think the king goes to C maybe. How is this? Um, the rook maybe goes. I hope the rook goes there. Save. <laughs> confused with the how it is moving the king when he castle mm. um, all right so what's next attack the rook does it sounds good? I think it does. So trade pieces, <coughs> take pawns. Make sure no one can promote. That's that's pretty much the idea. Mm -hmm. So if he goes for that, I can maybe do this to protect my pawn. I think... Oh, but then it's... So if I take... He takes... I take... Down... Down... Wow... I'm optimist because yeah I go up yeah I mean if we trade many pieces I think it's not so bad for me I have that feeling I just have to make sure that maybe I can do this. That's kind of crazy. Check and I take one rook. I don't like that song. Um, I'm throwing away pieces like that, but. It should be okay to have two rooks. I guess it is. <laughs> I guess it is. Um, I don't know what to think about this game. It just went. It escalated very fast, <laughs> and so we started with like a, a normal opening, and then it was like take, 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 take the whole time. Mm, yeah. Let's have the last one, then let's call it a day. This was a weird game. So we are playing black. Uh, we're playing with black. So again, need to work on an opening. Let's stick to this one. This is the queen side, which is very interesting because it always puts me on a very weird position. Mm. and it threads that if I do this we are going into a caravan if that makes sense probably doesn't but that's what I feel uh, which means my structure at some point 
Mm, okay, it's going for that. Let's try this. And let's maybe uh, let's go for that. I am so uncomfortable right now. I messed up some step right because this no actually this should be here but yeah okay moment of truth do I move forward and compromise my structure So I think he wants to do the oops he wants to do this that I will put my knight here because if he goes there I can simply take and if I stay there we trade some stuff mm. Let's see what he does. Okay, so the structure unfortunately is gone, which I assume is a bad thing for for the character. Mm, let's see. I cannot take. He will do a fork. Look at this position, it's just everything is so trapped. The bishop cannot move, this one can only go there. Mm. I'll go here so that if he goes there, I take. Uh, wait a sec. And then now I cannot castle. Hmm. Uh, let's see how far we get out of this situation. It's a nine minute, I'm already a six. Okay, here is the plan. I go for this, he takes, I take, he maybe takes, then I take. Get this out, I can, and I can castle. Let's see. And if he doesn't take, what do I do? Uh, wait, wait a sec, wait a sec. Mm, do I want that there? Not really. But do I want the knight around? No. So I go for this then. Uh, this one doesn't concern. Let's see. Maybe that, and I take, and then this guy can finally go out. Boom. Boom. Yeah, I mean... Going for the rook, no? I don't think so. He saw that, or maybe he just wanted to mess mess 
set my structure even more. I don't think I could be more exposed than this. Oh, I miss that. I totally miss that. Mm, let's see. If, he, if I don't take, oh, he can take with the queen. kind of reacting a little bit like that. Uh, oh, I didn't see that one coming also. Uh, let's see. Well, no, actually, I understand. This game was really going bad. I would really take some time to analyze these games. Um, probably there is still a little bit of uh, me being tired. That doesn't help. But, uh, but uh, I, 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 I didn't, I didn't play well. We have to be honest, though, that. I mean, I started the game with like a Karakan and um, or uh, something that resembles a Karakan and that's that's not my style of playing chess. I feel so trapped and then I had to open the position and I think, yeah, then you're super exposed. So you go from like close to super exposed and it's very easy to lose a game. Uh, yeah, I was very lucky to 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 get the queen at the end. So, what a uh, what a day! Day fifty one. In a moment, I'll analyze the game. If you're into that, stay uh, stay tuned for the video. If not, see you tomorrow for more chess.